I thought I'd do a quick update on my bike. Um, a few things have changed. I've got probably too many things on the handlebars now. I've got my Garmin verb there. Um, a clip from my mobile phone that I don't really use. Um, what else? Latest change I've made to the bike. Well, I changed over from the BBS. 02, which is now my brother-in-law's bike, to the BBS HD. Massive uh, improvement. Well, I was, I was happy with the other one, but um, made this, one, this one's made a big difference. I also changed the battery, obviously. Uh, I, de I decided to go with a 52 volt battery for this one, after my experiences with the 48 volt one <laughs> which means that most of the time I'm now in the good part of the charge. I 50 odd and above um, for most of the runs that I do. This has got double the number of cells as the other one. They're both, they're both, the other one was also um, 18, 650 cells. That, that, was, that had 65 Samsungs. That was 13S 5P. And this one is 14S 9P. So there's like double the number of cells, which makes a big difference. Uh, the latest thing that I've just done now is I've got I've, I've got a 42 tooth bling ring as you can see there on the inside and I've just put the old the other the, the, um, the fang 46 tooth one on here on the back I've got uh, I've switched up from a to a it's a 10 speed 11 to 42 tooth um, cog so in the easy skier now it's a one to one ratio, 42 at the back and 42 at the front. But I, I, was, no, I wasn't 100% happy with the speed, the cadence that I needed to pedal at to get, the, to get up a higher speed, which is the idea for putting this one back on. A bit tricky than I thought because uh, to get it on level, I, so it's not sort of moving around um, in respect to the other one, I've had to sort of put some spacers between it. I couldn't find some tubes, sort of tube spaces, so I had to use normal um, washers, and I built them up. I've sort of stuck stuck them one on top of the other. I think it's about six washers on there. <coughs> um, it's now pretty stable. Uh, what else? I need to test that out. The idea, what I think I'll probably end, end up doing, obviously, now having two cogs here, is maybe try and get the derailleur working, the, the shift working on here again. I've got a couple of those to try out. But at the moment I'll just change it manually. So I want it, when I want a bit more speed, I'll, I'll put it onto this one. And when I'm doing more hilly areas, I'll have it on the other one. The other change as well, which I needed to do when I changed the cog at the back was, before I was using the Shimano Saint, which is like a short, what they call it, a short hang derailleur. And, it was causing a lot of problems because this part of the derailleur, uh, when I went into the into the into the fastest gear, into the lowest gear, it was like way back here, and it was really difficult to move it up. I was getting sort of arthritis in my thumb trying to push the bloody thing up. So I switched the derailleurs over to a longer, a longer whatever they call them, uh, one. This one's much better now, and um, that's about it really. I don't think I've changed anything else. Okay, I'll update as I, if I do f do the fix on this, I'll update on that. And that's it. Bye.